Hi there, Will here, and today I'm in a tiny town in the middle of nowhere called von Weigstorp. It's about four hours away from Cape Town, which uh, makes it a new record for casual trips I've taken outside of uh, Cape Town on this channel. And I'm here to hang out and make some photographs, so I guess that's what I'll do. I'm not going to talk as much this video as I did uh, the last few ones. I feel like making uh, photographs and showing you some things and I might talk uh, for the long exposures at night because I'm uncertain about them since I'm going to be shooting some Sinistal 800T but besides that enjoy what you get to see and I get to see. This is going to be uh, my first roll of Sinistal 800T ever and uh, possibly my second last because I bought two never really been particularly interested in it but I figured this might be an interesting place to come see how it renders I just need to try find some areas that are actually lit up at night because there are basically no street lights I think there's three street lights in the whole town and uh, Last night we had load shedding, which means that the electricity got shut off at uh, 9 o'clock. So I made one picture last night before the power went out and uh, that was the end of that. But maybe tonight I'll have better luck. Goedemiddag. Jammer om te blauw, hoe gaat het? Kan ik voor jou snaaks een kwestie vragen? Zou je vreselijk omgeest dat ik een foto neem van jouw kar met jullie wat het hierin zit? Want die licht valt baie mooi op het en ik is een fotograaf. Ik stap... Ik ben fotograaf. Ja. Ik stap maar die stad rond en kijk wat goed is wat interessant lijkt. Het is eindelijk wat ik... Huh? Het is eindelijk wat ik doe. Het is eindelijk wat ik doe. Het is eindelijk wat ik doe. Voor, voor foto's zit? Ja. Moet niet worden, is dit is dit voor mij eie interessantheid. Oké, okay. baie dankie. Perfect. Wat is jou naam? Gert van Wijk. Gert van Wijk, van ja. Van Wijk Stortpa. Ja. Aangenomen kennis. I uh, had to cut old Gert off there, unfortunately, because he started talking about his boss. 
but uh, I had a 10 minute conversation with him further talking about all sorts of interesting disjointed things because he was uh, quite drunk I think but it ended with him trying to sell me his car which was actually slightly enticing at this point <laughs> anyway we're gonna get uh, into the Sinistil soon but for now a bit more portrait <laughs> photographing a church right now I can't even really get it on video because it's so dark but I'm gonna give it five minutes with 800t it really is dark around here it's uh, pretty much pitch black all around besides the few lights that are on and more and more keep going off makes it quite tricky for this long exposure story also can't really see where I'm going We'll just uh, photograph the police station, hopefully with some moderate success because it's the first place that's actually had uh, any light on around here. But I could talk you through why I chose to photograph it, which is because it had uh, this interesting uptick in like its facade. It's quite the retro architectural decision to have your roof point up to the sky. So. It was quite interesting, and it had a, a light to give me some of that juicy, sinister halation directly in the middle of the frame, so... If anything, I'll have that to work with. Quite chilly at the moment, too. There's like no damn light around here. I got the corner store owner to let me come in and photograph his uh, little shop though. Kind of thought it would be a bit ironic to make the sinister picture with uh, a fridge and blown out fridge lights and stuff in this tiny little town. I hopefully got a cool picture of the front of that shop though so it'll lead quite nicely into sinister meme looks. Anyway I've got three pictures left but uh, I need to go eat now. And I've pretty much walked the whole town and photographed everything that had a light in front of it, so... Maybe I'll do some star trails, or just leave the camera out overnight and see if that'll give me a uh, scene for once. Because I have such miserable luck photographing night scenes. But there is no moon tonight again, which actually does have a big impact on it. I don't know, I guess I'll see. Hopefully I got something out of that.
Hallo, hoe gaat het? Ik hou van jouw fiets. Ik zei, ik hou van jouw fiets. Kan ik een foto van jou op je fiets nemen? Ik ben net zo blij. Kijk, 1, 2, 3. Perfect. Klaar, dankie. Wat is je naam? Arno Arno. Arnold. Marno Arno. Marno Arno. Dat is een lekker naam. Mijn naam is William. Ja. Aangename kennis, Marno Arno. Maar ik ga weer rondstap. Een baie dankie. En geniet die fiets verder, en die dag. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. It was uh, good fun to be out uh, in rural South Africa again. This isn't necessarily part of my uh, rural South Africa series of videos and likely hasn't been titled as such, but you'll see there are some similarities between Van Weegstorp and Aberdeen. Although, to be honest, Van Weegstorp makes Aberdeen look like a metropolis because <laughs> it's even more rural and small, but I got some pictures I really enjoy out of it. And the Sinistal especially, uh, pleasantly surprised me, to be honest. I don't uh, care for the halation, it, it makes no difference to me, but uh, the way it rendered and the benefit of having a higher ISO film for some of the night stuff, a higher ISO film that doesn't actually have super intense grain, was quite cool. And uh, I might shoot some more of it, to be honest. The, 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 the tungsten balance is also something I'm keen on experimenting more with in the future, so. I'll see what I get up to, but uh, I hope my first roll of Sinistal was uh, a success in your eyes. It was in mine. And I'll see you next week.